Dub C here, and we're back with another MRE rash review. I'm out on a hike, and I figured I'd take a lunchtime and eat this MRE Nation Menu 43 Jalapeno Beef Curry and see what's what's it all about. So we'll get inside and check it out. I will show my video. Uh, I had a kind of a hiking flat tire, so to speak. Um, piece of my backpack broke. I had to stop and get that fixed up real quick. Um, old trusty. Hoping it holds out. But if anybody has any ideas for new backpacks, uh, just comment them down below. I'm looking for a new backpack. So let's go ahead and get started with this review. Hey, actually, um, I'm away to my doing an MRE review. I actually got a hiking flat tire, so to speak. So my strap broke on old trusty. So we're going to go ahead and try to fix her up. Uh, got, luckily, I got my Leatherman. I always carry a Leatherman surge with me to uh, see what we can come up with. And just like that, we are back on the trail. So I had to remove this piece that broke off and actually just threaded through this clip to see if it, and we'll see how long it holds up. All right, so we got menu 43 jalapeno beef curry. Let's bust it open to see what we got. We got the peelable seal at the top. Boom. Get the main out first. Jalapeno curry beef with potatoes. Hmm. Hopefully it's not overwhelmed by the potatoes like the other mains I've had. This is an Emory Star. We've got our FRH, which we will be using today. I'm trying to keep it simple. Oh, we got the white accessory kit. It comes. I've seen them these in the older ones. So we'll check that out in a second. We've got some Emory Star oatmeal cookies. Got a chocolate flavored first strike bar. I love first strike bars. And then we have looks like um, another accessory bag. So we'll go and open this one up, see what we got in here. Very interesting. Alright, so we got sweet and condensed creamer spread. Which I'll try that on the uh we got some memory star crackers. We got a beverage bag. We're trying to keep it light. We got quite a few stuff here. We got a peanut butter and an apple jelly. We got some true lime, true lemon, and then we have a fruit punch power stick beverage. We don't see any coffee, but we'll go ahead and bust this accessory kit open real quick. So it can be used as a bowl and stuff. All right, let's see what we got. So we got our spoon, we got our deep rich coffee, we actually got some toilet paper, napkins, um, wet nap, and some sugar. And then we got some Smarties. Okay, so we have our main curry beef, never had this before, uh, it's five digit date code from Memory Star, it's 2019, 122nd day. I added the salt to the FRH, and I'm going to... Get this thing going, and then we'll start opening stuff up. Okay, we got our main warming up. We'll go ahead and bust these uh, oatmeal cookies up. Got them opened up. We'll throw them in the mess. And it looks like it got uh, four cookies. Also, I don't think I've had these before either, so interesting to try out. I have had the chocolate first trike bar. I really enjoy those. Nice. Oh, let's throw that down. Luckily, it landed in my mess kit. It's got like a crisp rice, nice shiny texture. It's about 45 degrees, so it's not really cold out. And then I have the MRE Star crackers. Looks like they're uh, kind of broken up a little bit. So we might have to throw some in the main and then have some with peanut butter. Yeah, they're all busted up. Uh, have some with some peanut butter and jelly. And then we're going to, we'll skip coffee, but I'm going to have the Fruit Punch Power Stick Beverage. So we got our uh, Fruit Punch drink and mixing it up. So that's good. Now this is a, you know, like I said, there, there's a lot of components that are easy, perfect for hiking. Um, didn't want to mess with the accessory bag or anything extra with that. Just got my main cooking, I got my cookies, first strike bar, and some crackers. Do you also have um, some peanut butter and grape jelly? or apple jelly, sorry. And we're going to uh, actually just have some on the crackers real quick. All right, so we're gonna make some uh, little quick peanut butter and apple jelly sandwiches. 
put a dab of peanut butter on them. And then we'll add the apple jelly and pair them up. So they ain't gonna be perfect, but let's give it a shot. So we got the apple jelly and the peanut butter. We got a little peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Never get old of the uh, peanut butter and jelly sandwich. It's really good. The Emory Star Crackers are actually pretty good. They got a little bit, bit different texture than the normal Emory crackers. Uh, quite enjoyable. I'm gonna wash it down with this uh, fruit punch. Didn't really mix up that well. I'm trying to keep mixing it, but yeah, the fruit punch is not mixing up well for me. Um, I'm mixing it, but it's a little bit sour. I think only because it's not mixing up. And then we're uh, I'm gonna go ahead and try one of these oatmeal cookies. Small, pretty soft, not too uh, hard. Let's give a, a bite. Oatmeal was um, cookie was really good. It had a nice uh, crisp bite to it. A slight cinnamon, cinnamon flavor. Um, uh, it's cool because it's kind of smaller than the bigger ones, but uh, still a lot of flavor and they're still pretty fresh. So we're going to try a piece of the First Strike chocolate bar. Um, and you see there's a cross section. It's like a protein bar almost. Really dense. Uh, go ahead and give a bite. First Strike bar is really good to me, but I, I kind of like the artificial chocolate protein type bar taste. I've grown accustomed to it through the years of eating protein bars and stuff like that. So I really enjoy it. I like the crisp rice. But as far as actually being chocolate or tasting like chocolate, it's definitely not. Uh, so those who really enjoy chocolate may not like these. But I, I like I said, I, I do enjoy it. I do want to try something a little different. Um, I like chocolate peanut butter. So I want to add a little peanut butter to the First Strike Bar. And for those who might not like First Strike Bars and get peanut butter and not know what to do with it, Maybe try this out to uh, change it up. The peanut butter actually enhances the flavor and actually dulls down the chocolatey, uh, the chalky cho uh, chocolate taste. So it actually would improve it for those who maybe have problems with a pro protein bar taste. Main should be done cooking now. The FRH did a great job. Uh, it added that little bit of salt to it and just let it cook over there. Get ourselves a little hot meal. I'm excited to try this main. I have not had the jalapeno beef curry with potatoes. The only concern is, is I don't want to be overwhelmed by potatoes, but we'll see. It's hot. I can barely hold it. It's got the retort tears at the top. And there's a main. It actually has a second retort tear, retort tear spot for if you want to get um, a little bit closer to the main. All right, we're going to go for a bite of the main. We're just going to eat out of the pouch. It is pretty soupy. So that's interesting. Um, really, as far as uh, density, you can't really get a good bunch of stuff, but I'm trying to get a mega bite going on. I've got potatoes, beans, and the beef. Here we go. Well, that's actually pretty good. Um, it is pretty soupy, like really watery, but the curry flavor is fantastic, and it's not overwhelmed by potatoes. Like I recently had another main that had potatoes in it from Memory Star, and you could taste nothing but potatoes. This is not overwhelmed by that. The curry flavor is very strong. The bits of beef is really good. They got a good chewy texture to them. And it's got other vegetables in there that are pretty pronounced. So overall, the main by itself is really good. Um, but being like it's soup, I'm actually going to add some crackers to it to give it some more, um, just more depth and flavor and a little bit better texture. All right, I've added the uh, crackers to it. Let's go ahead and give it another shot. Crackers, mega bite beef curry that is the ticket it takes away from the kind of the soupiness and makes it more um, more of a texture more and more of like a main that I'm used to so I added the rest of the crackers to it I'm gonna go ahead and finish this up and we'll talk more in final thoughts so final thoughts on menu 43 jalapeno beef curry actually um, pretty impressed by the MRI star main the flavor itself was really good has strong curry flavor the items and sides are the beef really good texture to them really good bite um, a little bit soupy, but when I added the crackers, it became the MVP of the meal. Really enjoyable. As far as the rest of the MRE, uh, had some really uh, normal components as far as the first strike bar, but I really enjoy that. Adding the peanut butter to it was a huge uh, success. I think that would improve it for those that might not even like it. The oatmeal crackers uh, cookies were really good. And uh, I did not like the fruit punch drink, but I'm not a huge mixed drink fan. Um, I prefer water 
but I always try to try them just to see on some, certain ones. I do like the orange ones. I do like the little MRE Nation and Minotaur, uh, the little clear packagings. Or not clear, but they're white packagings, but they're clear drinks, but they have flavor to them, so it's pretty good. Um, but overall, good ration, um, and it worked perfectly outside. So that's all I got now. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.